Hi, my name is Dane Morrissey. I'm a fire captain with the Huntington Beach Fire Department. I'm here today to talk to you about food allergies. May 14th through 20th is Food Allergy Awareness Week. Over 32 million Americans are living with potentially life-threatening food allergies, including nearly 6 million children. Every three minutes, someone is rushed to the ER because of an allergic reaction to something they ate. What is a food allergy reaction? A food allergy is when your body's immune system reacts to a food protein because it's mistaken that protein as a threat. Symptoms can range from mild to life-threatening. Even trace amounts of a food allergen can cause a reaction in some people with food allergies. What is anaphylaxis? Anaphylaxis is a serious allergic reaction that comes on quickly and may cause death. Food allergies are the most common cause of anaphylaxis. Other triggers include insect stings, medications, and latex. So what are the most common food allergens? They are milk, eggs, peanuts, tree nuts, soy, wheat, fish, and shellfish. What are some of the signs and symptoms of a food allergy reaction? These symptoms can appear minutes after exposure or potentially be delayed hours after being exposed to the food. Uh, these symptoms can include swelling of the lips mouth and throat, widespread redness and hives throughout the body, and difficulty swallowing. Anaphylaxis can lead to difficulty breathing, wheezing, or ultimately cardiac arrest. How do we treat anaphylaxis? Epinephrine is going to be our first line treatment. Uh, steps that you should take um, if encountering this situation. If the victim is prescribed an epinephrine auto injector, such as an EpiPen, you're going to help administer it immediately. Call 911 and the Huntington Beach Fire Department will be arriving on scene uh, for continued treatment. We're gonna treat with epinephrine, Benadryl, and a breathing treatment such as albuterol, and ultimately take the patient to the hospital for continued care and treatment. It is very important for you to understand how allergic reactions affect our entire community and what you can do to help those at risk. The Huntington Beach Fire Department has established an epinephrine training program in order to prepare our community to respond to allergic reactions. And you can follow the link found in this post to sign up for this free training. We encourage everyone to get educated and trained in how to respond to this important public health issue. Thank you.